I've been wanting to talk about this for a while, but really I just wanted to wait for the right time to get this out of my system. I don't talk about stuff like this as openly as I want to because honestly I really don't feel like anyone would pay attention to it. I'm just a shy, quiet, adorable, anxious introvert and a lot of people are probably tired of hearing it and I don't blame you. Now I've had my fair shares with anxiety, but there were some times where it would become a daily struggle. There will be times where I'm panicking and I know what I'm panicking about, but there will also be times where it sneaks up on me and sucker punches me. There will be times that I'm thinking that everyone's eyes are on me and I will be thinking, I think they're going to severely judge me because they secretly think I'm worthless even though I have no proof of what they're thinking, even though they've been really nice to me. Honestly, that's why I'm terrified of meeting new people. Now, as a kid, nothing really bothered me that much, but something felt different. I always had this nervousness that followed me, but it wasn't always an intense nervousness. For example, I would go into a public restroom and I would feel like I was being watched from above, below, or through a crack in the stall door and I would finish and I would hurry my ass out of there. It felt like the older I got, my anxiety would grow worse. I was afraid to meet new people because I was worried they may judge me. I would always be in the house not talking to anyone and at night I would just be super paranoid for no reason at all. I know it's completely irrational, but I don't know, I just don't know why I get this way. There was this one time back in high school when I was just sitting in class one time just doing whatever. Now, like I said, sometimes my panic attacks would sneak up on me as I could punch me. This was when I was just looking at the teacher and all of a sudden my heart started pounding and it was getting really hard to breathe. Now, initially I thought it was an asthma attack, but I was never coughing. It was getting hard to breathe, and I started to panic, and my hands started shaking, and my vision was fuzzy, all noise was getting drowned out. I thought I was going to faint right there. I'm okay. I was so scared, I honestly wanted to run out of that classroom, run home, and hide in my closet, but instead, I went into the restroom and lied down on the floor, shaking and crying, praying that it'll be over soon. I honestly thought I was going to die right there, but the more I was accepting death, the more calm I got. Now, I think most of my anxiety comes from stress. Now, I do have a lot of ways coping with it, and I also have a lot of social anxiety because I feel like I'm going to get judged from the job. Well, when I have panic attacks, I always feel ashamed and embarrassed because I was so overwhelmed I forgot I could talk to someone. Now. To be honest with you, anxiety makes me a little distant and I wouldn't talk to anyone. I would just sometimes bottle up my emotions and at one point I would say to myself, Huh, this does not seem like a healthy way to deal with this. And I don't really talk about my emotions a lot, but here I am telling you guys my experience. I'm brave, and you're brave too. Mental health is important. You got this. You're not alone. If you need anyone to talk to, I would recommend a therapist or a close friend or a family member. Or if you want to talk to me, my socials are in the link below. Alright, you made it to the end. I love you all. Be sure to like and subscribe. Turn on the post notifications so you don't miss an upload. Remember, you are not alone.